Welcome, we are in my basement and we are playing here with the old Pentium 4. You know it, I already made a review about it, it's the Jewel. And uh, well, I want to install Windows 10 on it, I just want to try to see. And it's not supported, you cannot install Windows 10 on this thing. Because um, the processor is not supported, um, many things are not supported. But still we're gonna try. and. It will also not boot from uh, the Windows 10 CD. I'm getting uh, error 5. So we will have to overcome error 5. And to do that, we will... Um, let me think, how did we do that again? Oh yes, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna boot up from a Windows 7 that does boot on this machine. For instance, the 7100. You know, we're only gonna boot from it and then um, we're gonna hit repair my computer and up there we will go to the command line and then we will pop in the Windows 10 CD and go to the sources folder and then you know um, put the command to the drive and then change directory to you know sources and then uh, run set up from there and if everything goes good you know this thing should be running the Windows 10 setup. Only thing I don't know, and this is the GPT thing again, I'm not even sure if we can format the IDE drive into a GPT partition. We will have to see about that. And if I fail, then I still have this very beautiful Windows XP with the Windows Eight or maybe even Windows 10 look and feels well it looks just like my other machines that while it's running Windows XP almost obsolete but still fun to run on this machine but even more fun would be to see an install of Windows 10 on this laptop a Pentium 4 from a uh, year to thousand i think this thing was from 2001 or 2002 here it is <laughs> i still have it look at that man windows 7 built 7100 so we're gonna pop that one in if we can the cd room is not so good it's really oh fuck <laughs> <laughs> the cable went <laughs> okay then well then i don't have to well let me reboot it put the cd in and i'll get okay, back to i you. popped in the cd and now we're gonna see the old version of windows 7 booting up This won't give error 5, you see that? And now we are loading the files. I'm gonna let this load and then uh, I'll get back to you. Here we have the Windows 10 from Albert Hein. Yep, yep. And you must be careful with this thing, eh? Oh, you don't want to touch it, man. This battery is not even... I'm scared. Oh, I did it! Oh, man. This is so useless. I don't understand why this is happening. This is really dangerous. If I move the laptop for a second... Then there's something with this plug not so good. Okay, let's boot up from the CD. Uh, control Alt Delete. Where is Control Alt Delete? Uh, I cannot control. Oh, God damn. Okay, welcome back. So I popped in the CD, and I'm gonna hit F8. I hope I was on time. Yes, I was. And I'm booting now with a Windows 10, uh, with a Windows 10 7100, but it could be any Windows 7 not containing SP1, 
CD or DVD, install a DVD. I must be, be very careful not to touch this because it's very vulnerable, it can break anytime. So I'm gonna let this go and get back to you and go fix myself some tea. Do the same. Okay, there we are. So uh, now we're gonna hit next. And up here we're gonna hit repair your computer. But before doing that, you must uh, also remove this thing, this uh, CD-ROM. And now comes the trick, because now we're fooling Windows. I hope Microsoft does not get pissed with me, because this is just a hack to install the beloved Windows 10. <laughs> And in fact, this was also an evaluation. This was this was like a yeah, also a test version. Eh? I still have it, yo. I take very good care of my CDs, so it goes back. It feels all hot, man. Oh, this thing is warm. So now we're gonna hit repair your computer. Okay. This is an old trick, but it still works. Searching for Windows installations. Blah, de, blah. And Okay, use recovery tools, I think, or so. Yeah, and then next. And then we go to command prompt. And then we say, what is it? Uh, CD. I think this is D. Let me see. Uh, D, you see that? I just hit D double point and then I will say CD uh, sources. See that? Now it's in the sources of that CD. And then up here, we're just gonna hit set up. And if everything goes wrong, all right, people. We will come into the Windows 10 setup if everything goes right. It's reading, yay! We did it, baby. <laughs> Only thing I want to know now if it's possible to um, to format the partition into a GTP or GPT. What was it? GPT, yeah. Yeah, GPT partition. Look at that, baby. Oh, oh, this is so sexy. Look at that. On the Pentium 4, ladies and gentlemen. Windows 10, the best operating system ever. <laughs> wow. Wowie. Of course, it will not be fast. And probably, okay, let's, let's see if this is possible. I have 22 gigabytes here. Hey! Oh, it said I cannot be. So, yo, peeps. Now, if I hit delete and it say cannot bloody blah on this drive, maybe it will. We're just gonna say delete. I'm deleting everything, man. The whole machine. Goodbye, cool edit. Goodbye, goodbye, my friends. Yes. Oh baby, yes we do it. And now it can. So now it's creating a GT, GPT partition. So in fact everything is lost, the Windows XP is gone. 
with the Windows 8 skin, the video that I created about the Windows 8, I will do it on my Pentium 2, so we will do that video again. It's now also gone. So, um, yeah, this might take some hours, because it must be read from the CD, the DVD. So we're going to let that go, peeps, and uh, yeah, I'm going to get some myself some tea. What time is it? It's one o'clock in the morning. Time for a big cup of tea. Yep. So let this machine do the do. I got no errors. It's until now. Uh -huh. I wonder how this thing is going to boot. If it will boot. Of course it will boot. Why not? Dang. Look at that. Everything is still running. And it's going to reboot. There we go, peeps. Reboot. <laughs> Rebooting. No, I want to see the reboot. This is going to be a Pentium 4 booting Windows 10, people. This is unbelievable what we're going to see now. This is gewoon ongelooflijk. Ça c'est fantastique. Ça c'est très fantastique, madame mezel. Bravo. Bravo. This is a very, very fantastic, my friend. Oh, this is not fantastic. Oh, this is not fantastic at all. Your PC needs to restart. Please hold on the power. Oh, this is not fantastic. This is not fantastic. So, you see... I was tricked. I was tricked by Windows 10. I lost everything. All my files. All my belongings. All my stuff. This was such a nice little beautiful Windows XP computer. It was. It was, yeah. So, I must restart my computer. This thing will never start up. We can forget about it. Ça c'est fini. Ça c'est pas bon. This is just to trick us a little bit. To drive us crazy. It doesn't give the error immediately. Mais ça c'est pas bon. Ça c'est pas travail pas. I can remove the CD. It makes no sense. C'est pas de sense. Pour ça, ça rien. C'est pas bon. Je ne sais pas pourquoi pas, mais ce ne travaille pas.